Like I said, I'm pretty sure I, uh, what, what the hell was I locked onto? Why did he lock onto this old man from all the way over here? I was right here, and he's locked on to that old man at the corner, just reading a book. Hello, my name is Champ. Thank you for clicking on the video. Today I'm continuing to play Elden Ring, and as you can see, I am a dragon. I decided to switch up my build a little bit. I realized that whenever you turn into a, your dragon form, using that priest's heart, you have to deal with no armor, but you do get a little bit of your defenses raised. Not a lot, but a little bit. So I decided to go with uh, with that, but instead of going with uh, Dragon Cult Communion, I mean Dragon Cult uh, Incantations, I just did it for the Blue Dancer's Charm. So that's like a pretty signif significant boost to my physical damage. So, I'm most likely going to be doing more damage now than I did previously. Like, a lot more. I am a little bit more squishy, though. Oh. Huh. huh. Cool. Anyway, last time I was here... I just went straight here. To finish the... Mother of Fingers side quest. And I completely did... Just ignore this part. I never, I never went here. So apparently this is called a shaman village, I believe. And I just want to see what's in here. If I remember correctly, that's pretty. Shamans were used as minor archery. Huh? Just shook. Weird. They were used as premium materials for the insides of. Uh, those jars. So apparently they're good as, like, bonding agents like for the rest of the flesh in there or something. And I believe this is their village. So hopefully they can meet at least one shaman here just to see... At least they're still somewhat alive. Yeah, because when I read that they were all... Well, not all, but... A lot of them were captured, butchered, and stuffed in pots. It's, uh, felt a little bit bad for them. This is one of the prettiest places I've seen in this game so far. Well, pe most peaceful anyway. Ah. This tree is kind of different from the rest of them. It's a little withered. Golden Braid. Hold on. What is this? Now, is this an actual person's remains or just a statue? Secret incantation of Queen America. Only the kindest of gold without order. Creates a small illusionary er uh, creates a small illusionary earth tree that continuously restores the HP of nearby allies. America bathed the village of her home in gold, knowing full well that there was no one to heal. This was America's home village? Okay, so it's a talisman. Boosts holy damage negation but the utmost. A braid of golden hair cut loose. Queen America's offering to the grandmother. This is America's hair. Boosts holy damage negation but the utmost. What was her prayer? Her wish? Her confession? There was no one left to answer and America never returned home again. That's sad. Okay, so everybody went, everyone in here ended up dead. Or hunted down. Oops, well. I made a mistake. Can I teleport? <laughs> I'm gonna go through the main entrance now. Of the Shadow Keep. Oh, this direction. Oh, it's a knight. No, such a thing is utterly inconceivable. We have not been abandoned. Mesmer is the son of Queen Merica. Her grace would never abandon her own flesh and blood. 
<laughs> I highly doubt that. Mesmer is her son? Well, according to this guy. Then who would be the dad? Is it also Radagon? Well, he's dead. He's not gonna make it to all Elden Ring 3. Man, who do you think you are? I shouldn't just go ho go so gun ho. This place looks so interesting. Oh, little guys. Uh. Okay. What do you mean are these? Are they demi humans? Are they little elves, dwarfs? I mean, I know they're called militiamen, but being a militia isn't exactly a a race or a species. Just because they're annoying to fight. Yeah, I'd rather just snipe them. <laughs> I'm not going to wear that. Wait a minute, what? Be summoned to assist Needle Knight Lita. Be summoned to assist Horn Sense. I don't want to kill either of them. Let's explore the rest of this area first. And then... I'll let myself be summoned to assist in murder. But I don't want to kill either of them, man. What the heck? Golden Vow. Took his shoes. I've been here, I think. Oh! I 100% just did not see him. Ugh. I'm stuck in a tree! That was stupid. <laughs> Man, I just did not even recognize that someone was going right after me. Nice, smithing stone one. I needed that. The only things left to do is go down that ladder that leads to leads to the moat, and also, you know, just drop down. Yeah, this is yeah, this is the beginning. Yeah, I jump down that ladder that leads to a moat, and then let myself be summoned to uh, kill one of my friends. Well, the horn sense isn't isn't exactly my friend. He was sort of hostile on first introduction. Or was that ladder? Here we go. Huh, just a hole. What are these the two? It's interesting. This is never a good idea. All right, let's go slowly. Sewers and wells are never good. Okay, so it's just uh, a painting. Where is that at? Domain of Dragons. Oh, it killed me. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Okay, this one a bit annoying to find. Wait. What the hell?
Okay. <laughs> Are consumed in the ancient original form of Dragon Communion. Use while disrobed to turn once human flesh into an ancient dragon. The change cannot be undone except by death. Using this heart, uh, sure. The last thing the particular saw with human eyes was a sunset. Its colors faded and tarnished, in a remote thing from eternity. Okay, how does this one look like? Oh, the the half dragon guy I fought. Uh, I don't know which one I like more, this one or the priest one. I don't know which one's defenses are higher, this one or the the priest's heart one. Oh, whatever. When I die, I'll go ahead and try the other one and compare. Okay. Needle Knight Lita or Horn Sense? Who should I assist? Ah. Uh, okay. I want to say I should assist Lita, but I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Who should I help? This guy was pretty much hostile from the get go. But if I help her, I'm a simp! Oh, actually, oh, honestly, I don't care about that. <laughs> she was losing her faculties there. I'm just, I mean, I did learn that Mikola, it's kind of unhinged. From St. Trina. She told me that I need to kill him. And she's a fanatic for Mikola. And this guy, he said we were allies, but not really... Okay, so these guys have shown hostility towards me, she has it. So let's help her. Worthy Hornetan, I will dispose of you. Before your thirst for revenge beckons our undoing, I can no longer trust your word. Let's power up. In the end, I knew this day would come. The nature of your kind, I am certain, will always show itself. Give me time. Interfere not with my business. What a surprise that you should join me. I am pleased. Now go and make yourself useful. I already buffed you, girl. Um. Don't die yet. Let's see. Well, whatever. <laughs> she killed him. Apologies. Oh, mother. Wife. Uh, and child. Kindly Mikula never betrays a vow. That's sad. Go. Your family awaits you. I didn't even need my help. I mean, I did buffer. Made her defense and attack go up, so. <laughs> I was looking for perfumes. Okay. Falks. Caterpillar mask, gross. Caterpillar mask. Uh, why is he wearing that? Grotesque mask constructed from countless solidified caterpillars. A ritual implemented of the greater potentates of Bonnie Village. You know what? Maybe he was a bad guy. <laughs> I feel like everyone in Bonnie Village is a bad guy, so maybe, yeah. Uh... I guess I, it was a good thing I helped her. Used to ward off thoughts of impurity, doubt, temptation, and other weakness one is vulnerable to while absorbed in divine ritual. Yeah, sure. Divine ritual. S butchering people and stuffing them in jars. Uh, I guess I made the right choice. Where does this go? I think this goes down? This may be where it leads to the... the finger place. Or not. Oh, I am going down. Okay. Or am I? Ah! 
I knew it was gonna be something around the corner. Die. Ash of War, Wall of Sparks. Perfumers, Ash of War. Huh. Oh, I can hear flies. To what ends do they make these? Like, why are they making these pots full of humans? Like, why make why make these creatures? Oh, a grace. Nice. Where am I? Okay, so I'm going to a new area. Oh, finally going over here. Um... I don't want to exit the Shadow Keep just yet. I want to complete it. But I'll just open this. Wait. What's this door? Huh, alright. Can I summon Torrent? Yes, I can. Oh, I didn't get that item. What the heck? What the heck? What? What? What is happening? It was just raining l fire. That's what, that's what I was killing the bats. What the heck? Why was it happening? That was very odd. There it is. Why is that happening? Oh, I see. Ow. There's some kind of spellcaster all the way at the end. Here you go, Torin. Yeah, it's this guy. Okay, going down, buddy. You got a big head. You got a noggin on you. What's up with that head of his? Salsa's hood. Rain of fire. Oh, okay, let's check out that hood. Like, what the heck was up with that globious noggin of his? Salsa's hood. Hood of Salsa. Sage of the Fire Knights. A prodigious amount of cloth wrapped around it, giving the impression of a greatly swollen head, and wearing it increases intelligence. The disciple of the Elder Wigo, he refused to burn down an old ruin at the risk of his own life. Okay, so it's just a bunch of cloth. So he didn't have a swollen brain or something. Ancient Ruins of Rawa. Rau. Rawa. Rau. Rawa. Okay, let's go back to the Shadow Keep. Like I said, I'm pretty sure I, uh. What? What the hell was I locked onto? Why did he lock onto this old man from all the way over here? I was right here. And he's locked onto that old man at the corner. Just reading a book. Yeah, I'm just gonna do a quick sweep of this place. Because apparently there's two NPCs here, and they're just reading. And I have a feeling I can find something in this place that will help him out. Oh, this is, this is where this guy was. It does make one think. Perhaps yes, it does. Concerns are but two sides of the same coin. Sure, man. You're not even going to comment that I'm a dragon now? How common are dragon people? What the hell hit me? Did him just move into the side? Give me damage? Okay. Yeah, I think this is the boss of this place behind that door. Oh! I thought that needle eye shot, but flames. I 
Ugh. Wing Serpent Helm. Ash of War Flame Spear. Okay, cool. So this guy's not gonna be coming back. Yep. The boss is probably behind that door. But I wanna finish exploring this place. Stop saying that. Last time I talked to you, you said you didn't need any help. Nice, this is where I saw. Wait. Okay. Storehouse cross message. Scatter tree blessing? Scatter tree blessing? Rather? Okay, what did you abandon here? I abandoned here my arm dextral. Now, where do I go from here? This place is big. But honestly, I kind of like it. It feels more, uh, civilized. I like that there's, uh... Oh, just a bunch of bats. Oh, I don't like that, but... I just like the whole... The uh, books and the researchers and stuff. That's a cool feel to it. Okay, cool. Holy proof pickled liver. Secret right scroll. And I think that's probably it for this area. Okay, let's uh, check those out. Message left by Sir and back. Addressed to kindred spirits who also pursue Mikolas' trail. It would seem that the people of the keep have flooded the holy quarter that leads onward to the scattered tree, bearing as access. Barring access. However, there's no th however, there is no route that leads there from this storehouse. Perhaps there is another way to reach the holy quarter from somewhere else in this keep. And then I think it was a key item. A scroll made of white tree bark. If you can decipher the scroll, which describes the secret rite of the Divine Gateway, said to be found at the tower and shrouded by shadow, a lord will usher in a god's return, and the lord's soul will require a vessel. I found something that might help you. Hmm. Perhaps I can... Yeah, there we go. This? Yes. Yes, I should have known. Even the truth was itself mere folly. As if using Lord Moog to gain entrance to the Land of Shadow were not enough, he plans to use his corpse as the vessel of his king consort. What? He has forsaken Lord Moog's soul. He desires only his empty shell. It beggars belief, but I'm afraid Tender Mikola fails to grasp the humiliation implied by this act. Tender Mikola? My dear lord deserved better. Righteous tarnished. You have my gratitude. You're welcome. You have given me the answers I needed, but I can hardly fathom it. Such folly unto the end. I am a warrior, but I've aged. I cannot afford to act hastily. Curse it all. I know my limits. I could spend the rest of my life honing my craft, and still that creature would be out of my blade's reach. The absolute folly of it all. Anything new, my man? Righteous tarnished. My old man. Could you please give there this you go. to Freya? Thanks to you, she too will have the answer she requires. Freya possesses a youth I no longer have. This knowledge will surely stoke the flames of valor within her. Yes. I can see her barreling into the fray right now. Letter for Freya. Perhaps I shouldn't meddle in her affairs, but this is the only way I can help. Let's see this first. A letter written by Sir Ansbach, Ansbach to Freya the Redmane, presumably written in answers to a curry by the pages nearly folded. Neatly folded to keep prying eyes from reading it. That's not gonna stop me, dude. I'm afraid I'm a bit truly. Yeah, here, just take this. Sir Ansbach, to me. Yes. What earth could it? Hmm. 
Hmm. Yes. Of course. I see. As the festival of war concluded, General Radan's soul met an honorable end. I killed him. Kindly Mikola wishes to revive it, which is fine by me. I know it would pain old Jeren, but war has always suited General Radan best, and certainly far more than any honorable death. Endless war to invigorate the soul, as befits General Radan, the great lion. Thank you. You're welcome. Now I finally cast off my misgivings. Give my regards to Honorable Ansbach. Sure. Tell him, if we should meet in battle, to face your bow would be fine enough, but to face your blade would be an honor. Golden Lion Shield. All that remains is the fight for our kind Mikola. Fight? Okay, she keeps saying that, but... Why exactly do we have to fight? Okay, so Mikla stole Moog's body because it's soulless. And Mikla's gonna use it for something. It's a puppet, I guess. Oh wait, this is not where Ansbach is. Yeah, I guess he's just gonna use it like as a puppet or something. While she's gonna revive Radon's soul. For whatever reason. I mean, it says that he needs a vessel or something to become God. So I guess Moog is gonna be the vessel? Perhaps I shouldn't meddle in her affairs. But this is the only way I can help. Well, she said thank you. <laughs> I should have expected as much from Freya. Some things simply never occur to her. Paralyzing fear. True despair. That's Freya through and through. Ah, there you are. I'm afraid Sir Anne's back will have to be next. Oh, cool. He insists that he's nothing but a worn down over the hill soldier. But in his day, he was the feared commander of the pure blood knights, who cleaved open Nicola the Kime with his blood blade. He claims he hasn't the spirit to take up his sword again, but I doubt it'll be very long before he recalls, as I have, the cascading sheets of blood. I'm afraid he cannot be left to fester. Well, she wants to kill pretty much anybody that's realization. Like there's ample evidence. Okay. Without kindly Nicholas influence. I'm quite mistrustful of others. What do you mean without Nicholas influence you're mistrustful of others? Even with Mikola, you're extremely distrustful. Alright. Ants back. Or Lita, who should I, who should I help? Uh, you know what? I think I should probably help this guy. The only reason I helped her against a horn scent was because he was clearly hostile towards me. This guy on the other hand. He seems to have his wits about him somewhat. Well, she's kind of looking to be a little bit insane. So let's help him. Let's help him out. I find that I have a new apprehension. Your ambivalence. And exactly where it might lead you. So, you would call an old man such as I. You are thoroughly indeed, Lady Meta. I would expect nothing less. As you surmise, I do have my doubts. And will not simply lay down and die with them. 
Have you lost your wits? By my troth, you have no such debt to this old man. Though I gladly welcome your decision. Now I might even live to see the morrow. Ow. There we go, that might help him a little bit. Looks like she's using holy. Okay. So you've chosen your side, have you? Yes, I have. Despite having no debt to the Lord of Blood. I suppose it was Sir Amphak who won you over. Fine. One more heart for my blade to skewer. You're insane, Lita! You are kind of cool, though. All right, take over, old man. <laughs> he just shot her on the head. Perhaps I should have known. There you go. To challenge the two of you alone, I take my leave for now. Lady Leda, I ask you keep kindly Mikola in your care. Sorry, Lita, but you kind of lost your mind there. You were just... <laughs> she just kept looking for the next person to take on. This is, I believe, where I went to, uh... The Finger Ruins. It was that way. But I don't think I ever went out here. Oh! Well... Boss, what it is. Damn it. Oh, come on. It's fast. He has some insane range. He's not that hard, though. It's not that hard. Ah. There's such, there's such wide sweeping attacks. It's his, it's his boar and him attacking. You get roll catch as well. He's not that tough, though. <laughs> He's not that tough. I just realized I've only gotten him to a second phase like three times. What the heck? He's not that bad though. He's not that bad. But I think I, I, I got him now. I got him. Yeah, it's hard to dodge whenever he just does it from super up close. Damn it. Okay, I thought I was gonna do that swipe. Oh, there it is. Oh, my God. Okay.
Run away from that! Run away from that! Damn it! Did that really hit me? Ah! Uh. Okay. Damn it! Making mistakes I shouldn't be making. Okay. I got my cool back. I can't believe that hit. I screwed it up. Well, I can't believe it. I messed up my timing. Oh, damn. Okay, I'm getting a little bit greedy. There we go! I can't believe that broke his poise at the end. Where am I? Where is this? I could have fought this guy a long time ago too, I just never even walked here. Alright, so that's one boss. One more to go. Wait, where is this anyway? Okay, I'll do this later. I'm just, I'm just gonna check out what this remembrance gets me. Fight the boss of the Shadow Keep, which it has to be Mesmer, right? Pretty sure it's Mesmer. And then after that, call it a day because I'm getting tired. Okay, it's Sword Lance, Blades of Stone. Weapon once wielded by Commander Gaius. A combination of greatsword and lance. Weighty and capable of being brought to bear with great force, this armament shows its true potential when used astride of mounts. Gaius himself was never without his bore. Spinning Gravity Thrust. A gravity skill honed by disciples of an alabaster lord. Uses gravitational power to hang in the air before rotating the body and charging forward. An additional input allows for a follow-up attack. Blades of Stone. Gravity manipulating sorcery of Commander Gaius. Pulls blade-like clumps of rock from the earth. Charging increases potency. Gaius and Radon were good rivals in their youth. And this sorcery is a product of their friendly competition. Huh, cool. Anyway, boss time. And I died. Cool. <laughs> After all that, I lost to this guy. All right, all right, let's get this... wait. What? Oh. I thought it was gonna be right there, like immediately. Okay, cool. Okay, let's get started. You should be in here, right? Messmer boss fight. I just realized I didn't even check if I could summon cooperators. Oh. I get to see the cutscene and ultra wide. Mongrel intruder. That tarnished, it seemeth. Mother, wouldst thou truly lordship sanction in one so bereft of life? Yet, my purpose standeth unchanged. 
those stripped of the grace of gold shall all meet death. You're crazy, dude. In the embrace of Mesmer's flame. I am gonna kill you and take that for myself. Nice opening. Ah, oh, hurt. Nice spear. You're kind of lanky, dude. Nice. Oh, damn. So, using a script spear, a Smith script spear. Those suck, dude. Wait. Flames, protect me. Am I gonna survive this? Stripped of nope. the grace of gold, shall all be dead. In the embrace Ow. of Mesmer's flame. Okay. Mesmer the Impaler. Well, he lived up to that name. You anime ass scarecrow. Damn, he is fast. Damn it! I gotta get impaled. I'm dead. Stripped of the grace of gold, shall all be dead in the embrace of Mesmer's flame. <laughs> right where I la died last time. Ah! Oh, I'm gonna die immediately. Hey, I survived it. Kinda. Ah, he stopped my jump. Oh. There you go. I will not suffer. A lord devoid of light. No, oh, mother, forgive me. Ah, huh. wait, he's gonna pluck his own eyes out? What the hell? Dude, your glass eye. 
What does that symbolize exactly? Oh, that snake he has on his back. What is a What's happening? Soon tarnished. My buff better not be out. Ugh. Wilt thou be taken in the jaws of the abyssal serpent shorn of light? What the? Base Serpent Mesmer. Get along with Rykart swimmingly. Oh, lightless I died. creature. <laughs> Embrace thine oblivion, as shall I. You are ugly, my guy. But you know what? What chance does a snake have against a dragon? Ow. And I died. <laughs> In the embrace of Mesmer's flame. Honestly, he's not that difficult. I don't know why I've died so many times. Okay. Okay, okay, that's fine. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, that was just me panic rolling, unfortunately.
Come on! There we go. Marka. A curse upon thee. Oh, what? Now you hate your mother? <laughs> Remembrance of the Impaler. Mesmer's Kindling. Oh. <laughs> My null runes. Oh, I'm tired. Oh, my body hurts. A kindling that burned inside Mesmer the Impaler. A dark thing eaten away by a wicked serpent. Burns a ceiling tree said to be found at the old Ra ruins. Mesmer, much more like, much like his younger sister, bore a vision of fire. Huh. So, she... They're related? Melina or whatever her name is? Our supposed maiden. A malevolent snake writhe within Mesmer, and so his very mother plucked out his eye and put it in its place a seal of grace. Yet, having done so, her fear compelled her to secret away her child within the sh realm of shadow, hidden away, keeping company keeping company with the original sin and a hatred that would not be confined. So he does hate her, because he was born with a snake. An incarnation of Mesmer the Impaler. Summons Mesmer's flame to form a giant floating orb. The orb soars towards a foe, crashes into the earth, and explodes after a brief delay. Chen charging enhanced potency. Mesmer despises his own fire. Time and time again he hoped to rid himself of it, but ever did it burn. Weapon of Mesmer the Impaler, a great spear with a warped blade in the shape of undulating flame. Remade by the forging arts of the Realm of Shadow, this weapon can be thrown by executing a strong attack, dashing strong attack, or mounting strong attack. Charge the attack to produce flame on impacts. Unique skill Mesmer's Assault. A fierce succession of attacks using a flame-coated spear tip. Repeated inputs allow up to two follow-up attacks. The final move thrusts a spear into the ground, causing countless spears to form its running area. Damn. That's sick. Guys' is Greaves? Wait, Guys' is Greaves? Is that the guy I, I fought earlier? Was he Noble Neric? There's no way. It's Greaves. Black Iron Greaves made for Commander Gaius. A cruel joke, for he could not wear them. Riding on top of the boar he called his other half, Gaius was in fact a warrior of Albaneric extraction. He was! Oh, he was one hell of an humble Neric. He's, he, was, he gave me a tough time. I'm being punished. Well, with that bit of animal cruelty out of the way, I think that's it for today. I did a lot. I killed a, I killed Mesmer, Gaius. Uh, I invaded a few people. The Horn Sense, and then I betrayed Lita, I guess. Finish Shadow Keep. Double these up twice. It's uh it was eventful. And next time I need to do the ruins uh what is it? Ancient ruins of Ro. So this is for next time. Thank you so much for watching. And hope to see you next time.